Hello. Welcome to uh, the daily coffee video. Just got to sit down, have a nice little cup of joe. You know, I have a cigarette too. I don't know if I can do this on YouTube. I don't really care because you know, like that. I don't really care. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, no. Get yourself a coffee. Sit down. And just enjoy the vibes, I guess. Ignore the uh, bed in the background. Also, there's my cat. Hello. <laughs> Ignore my bed. Uh, I've been. I'm washing my duvet covers and all that, so it's just like very in the nude right now. Also, ignore that mess of wires. That's just I don't even know what I don't even know. I cleaned up my room earlier, and they were on like the little uh, little table right next to me, but I moved them because I was wiping them down. You know, giving them a nice little bit of disinfection. And yeah, so I just moved them over there, and that's just where they're gonna be. That you're just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> so yeah, if you've been watching this channel, you'll probably know that I tried to quit these, like, almost a month ago, and I got to day nine, and then I kind of failed. And since then, I haven't uploaded on this channel. That's Cafe Gold. They do it good. Uh, so yeah, I... After I failed to quit smoking, I kind of, like, fell into a little bit of a... little bit of a rut. Where I just kind of felt like, oh, I... You know, like, you know how failure feels, right? So, when that happened, I felt very ashamed of, you know, uploading these videos, trying to make it look like it was easy, because at the time, it felt very easy for me to just not be on these, but then I just had one day where it was like, fuck, this is hard, this is, this is really difficult. So I'm gonna try and make another attempt tonight. Well, tomorrow. I'm gonna have my last smoke tonight. Well, last smoke. I'm, I'm gonna give it my best. I, I promise I'll give it my best. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing this little, this little coffee chat routine every day. So if you see me without a smoke, then you'll know that I'm you know, not smoking. But if you see me with a smoke, you know that I have failed. And, yeah. Figure it's better what... It's a better thing to do than, you know, making a little short on YouTube and saying, like, oh, yeah, I've... I've day nine, guys. Day nine. Yeah, but... Figure it's a better way to do it if I just... You know, like, non-verbally say it. You get me? Speaking of the channel, uh, I've been doing a little bit of rebranding. I've deleted, not deleted, I've privated most of my videos. So that I can sort of focus on like really bringing the message that I want to bring across to people in a more effective way. Because I felt like most of the videos that I had uploaded weren't really that high quality. And I'm trying to like, I'm trying to fix that because what I'm trying to do on this channel is I'm trying to help people. I'm trying to like, you know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to connect, unify people who may not have had like a connection to other people like themselves before. And I really want to have like a very open, diverse community where we're all focused on just making the world a better place. Because, it, like, the times are dark. Times are dark, quite honestly. And I really want to do my part in trying to fix that. And trying to help 
the people of this world. That being said, like, I am gonna at least try and make some money out of this channel. I, it's not the main focus, it's like, maybe the second or third, right? It's helping people, it's the message, then it's the quality, and then it's money, right? That's sort of how I'm choosing to see it. And even then, I don't even think I want to make money off of these videos. I, I think I, I might just go do something else because I don't really want to profit off of such an honest and sincere message. I just want it, like, the message itself is the reward for me. Like, doing the work that I do, that's the reward for me. You know, like, I'm not really motivated by monetary gain anymore because I've just kind of learned to like accept the fact that if I'm not happy without money I'm probably not going to be happy with money like I kind of you know like I really want to focus on the mental health aspect of things I think doing these sort of videos where I can just sort of speak honestly, speak my mind, like be sincere, be authentic, I think that might honestly really help because I don't get to do that a lot. Like I don't really get to be myself. I, I don't really get to be authentic. I don't really get to speak my mind often. Like in, in like with my friends and all, right? It's like I sort of have to portray like a character of myself and it gets kind of tiring like it, it really gets kind of tiring and I really want to have that place where I can be authentic and I hope if by me being authentic I'm helping you then that that's like perfect that's that's what I want to do here Another thing I've been doing is I've been recording my videos in like bursts, right? So it's like I record five to seven videos in one day. And I've been, I've found that when I've done that in the past, the work was lower quality. But I think that was also just because of the topics I was choosing to discuss, right? For example, the, like one of the only videos that I have up on my channel still uh how to be more confident now that was a video that i recorded in one of those quick bursts i didn't expect that one to blow off because quite honestly like what i said in that video was it felt very low quality right like it felt very much like all right how to be more confident now uh yeah, sure, write that down, write that down, write that down. They'll eat it up, they'll eat it up. You know, like, it felt very dis disingenuous to who I was. But I got, like, a bunch of comments of people saying, like, you well, a bunch of comments. There's, like, three comments. But I got one comment that really stuck with me, which was, I want to be your friend. And, like, you know, it was probably a bomb, but... You know, like, that, that means something to me. Like, that really made me realize that what I'm doing here is being a friend. What I'm doing here is, it's almost like I'm trying to talk to you right now. And, I don't know, like, it just... It felt motivating. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing, after this video, I'm gonna be doing a, uh, gonna be recording a few videos that I have written down. And here, I'll go through them actually, why not? on very quickly. Check this one out. That was a 
script for a podcast that I was going to do at the beginning of last year, where I was essentially just going to document like the self-improvement journey that I was on. And I, like, this is basically like the, the lore, if you will, of who I am and who I was. And, uh, yeah, no, that kind of evolved slowly into this. And, you know, throughout last year, I didn't really do that much, like, work-wise. Like, I fucking, I graduated from secondary school, which, where I'm from, that's, like, high school, right? That's what you do before college. And I just kind of worked out. Like, that was really all I did because I, I had just become addicted to working out. I didn't really do much else besides that. And the video, the video that I'm going to have coming up with this video that I've been trying to get up for two days, by the way, it's, it's a real nightmare. My, uh, my laptop over there, see it, uh, that laptop, the charger kind of like it's being all funky and all right. So it's like, it's hard for me to really upload videos off of that. So I've been uploading them off of my phone. And it takes so long on phone. I keep running into so many problems when I'm trying to upload them. Like, it'll just say error, can't upload video and like all that sort of stuff. And it's like, come on, man. I've been, I've been trying to upload that for two days now. And yeah, that video is basically about how you need to take action to achieve your goals, right? It's like, it's addressing the problem that I had last year where I kind of didn't grasp the concept that I need to actually put in the hours and like it. It's very much a personal video. Like, I don't really know who else I'm gonna be able to help with that video, except for someone that's that was like me, right? Where they couldn't really grasp the concept. Cause like, bully me for this all you want, right? But I've, I haven't had like a full-time job or even a part-time job and yeah, like, this is the only job that I've really had. So, I've never really grasped the concept that I need to put in the work, right? And that video basically goes over, like, no, you, you need to put in the work. You need to take the steps to get closer to where you want to be. And you need to put in the hours to get closer to where to that goal, Right? That's like, that pretty much summarizes it up. It's like a four minute video. And I just kind of waffled on because it was the first video that I recorded that day. So I wasn't really like warmed up, right? And uh, yeah. So video, video ideas that I have written down. The next batch. I have this video, the coffee chats. Uh... I have it written down. Have a coffee and write down video ideas. Do it daily. All right. Oh, shit. All right. Okay, so I need to write down video ideas, too, right now. Hmm. I mean, quite honestly, I don't, I don't want to keep this video going on for too long. It's already 15 minutes long. And I'm just... These videos are going to be authentic. Like, I'm not editing them. I'm just speaking... The way that I speak, I'm, you know, I'm putting them out there just for the people that want that sort of authenticity, right? Because I know, like, that's a thing that's really lacking nowadays. Next video idea I have, this is going to be the video that I record after this one, is confidence, right? That's just, that's the title. It's just confidence. That's another thing I've been trying to work on. It's just the title game. Uh, so yeah, the, the basic premise for that video is, what is it really? How do we be more confident? And I'm basically just going to be discussing like 
What is confidence? As someone who doesn't know what confidence is, what is confidence? You get me? Next video after that, the lie about video games. Uh, I'm just going to be calling out the bullshit about video games being bad. Because, like, in healthy amounts, once you've done what you need to do for the day, it's fucking fine. Like, don't be listening to these people saying, Oh, no, uh, video games are bad. One hour video game is bad. It doesn't matter. It, it isn't that deep. Because, like, you can get all the work you need to get done done and then it's fine like as someone who has quit video games as someone who doesn't really play that many video games it's fine it it's honestly fine and people just want to shit on it because they know it's like a simple joy that doesn't have many bad side effects and they want to take that away because that helps their profits. That helps them get their money up. Because you're going to be like a little bit less happy than you were. And you're going to think, oh, well, uh, this person told me to quit video games. And uh, I've done that, so I might as well keep listening to them. When it's like making you less happy. Because that's how people profit off of everyone nowadays i have a whole video coming up on what i just said there like people profiting off of making you more depressed uh i can't wait to put that one out because i think that one is truly like a very valuable video and it calls out like the dark side of like companies influencers like all that sort of stuff i'm really excited to put that one out there see what people think about it video after that is I want to be your older brother weird title I know but basically I just with these videos I just want to help you succeed in life like I just want to help you in a meaningful way and I think I think I can do that because I like I'm I'm young right I'm 19 so I haven't experienced that much in life. But in a way that makes me more relatable to the people that are younger than me. That are going through like those, you know, those awkward years where it's like, you know, you can't really. Those years where you feel out of place. And I really want to be the older brother that some of you may have not had and actually like, give my limited life advice, right? Basically just talking about, like, how I've gone through life. And by no means have I gone through life the right way. There's no right way to go through life. Because, you know, in life, it's like... Your life is very different to my life. And that's just how it is. Like, you know, no... no Two living creatures on this planet have experienced life the same way. And I really want to... Like, I just want to be that someone that has experienced a different life, maybe, than you. Who can give some advice that does actually benefit you. Video after that, how to speedrun self-improvement. Uh... Yeah, no, th this one's a very simple one. I, like, literally, I have a five, six-step plan written underneath about how to actually speed run self-improvement. I'm just gonna list it down. First, you focus on the mental. Then you focus on the physical. Then you focus on social life. Then you gain wisdom. You gather wisdom. And then you focus on your financial life. And step zero... Step zero of this plan is have faith or have a religion that you look up to. And don't have a religion just so you can improve. Have a religion because it actually means something to you, right? Like be religious because it's meaningful to you. Example, right? I'm a follower of Christ, so 
For me, a lot of my motivation comes from wanting to please God. Like, what I'm doing here is to please God. Like, I want to help people to please God. I want to help people so I can bring heaven... Like, I want to help people so I can do my part in heaven, right? And if I'm actually going to go to heaven or not, I don't really know. But if I try to bring some aspect of heaven to this earth and I end up going to hell I'm fine with that like I'm fine with it I don't mind suffering for all of eternity if I know that I have at least tried to help yet me and then video after that effortless progression is key Find the way to put in effort effortlessly. That's why I have right underneath. And basically what that's talking about is, you know, just be effortless in how you progress in life. You'll know you're doing the right thing if it feels effortless to do. You got me? So yeah, that's all the video ideas I have written down. Uh... Gonna be recording those after this one. Keep an eye out for them. I have four more videos that I recorded last Friday coming out. All pretty short, like less than five minutes. This is the this is probably gonna be the longest video. This is probably gonna be the longest video format that I'll have on my channel. Cause it's just where I can be authentic, just talk, you know? Just really try and connect with you. And yeah. Finish my coffee now. Gotta get to recording. Keep running. But no one else is.